Hey guys, welcome back to our channel. Today we have some tragic news to share about the beloved actor Treat Williams. As details continue to emerge about his fatal motorcycle accident on June 12, 2023, it has been revealed that Treat Williams was still alive at the scene of the crash. According to authorities in Vermont, Treat Williams known for his work in Hallmark movies, suffered critical injuries in the accident. Lieutenant Steve Coote of the Vermont State Police Department confirmed that William was treated at the scene before being airlifted to a New York hospital. Unfortunately, Treat Williams did not survive and passed away later that evening. Colleagues and fans of Treat Williams are still coming to terms with this sudden loss. Many of his Hallmark co-stars and friends have been sharing touching tributes to the beloved actor. Treat Williams, who was 71 years old at the time of his death, had left an indelible mark on the industry. The updated police report reveals that the accident occurred on Route 30 in the town of Dorset, Vermont. It was reported that 35-year-old Ryan Koss, driving a 2008 Honda Element, attempted to make a left turn into a parking lot. Unfortunately, he turned into the path of Treat Williams' motorcycle, leading to a collision. Williams, who was wearing a helmet, was unable to avoid the accident and was thrown from his motorcycle. The accident took place in front of Long Trail Auto, where owner Matt Raffin, a friend of Treat Williams, witnessed the tragedy. Raffin immediately called 911 and rushed to the scene, hoping that Williams would pull through. He reported that Williams was responsive to his questions, raising hopes for his recovery. Once emergency services arrived, Treat Williams was airlifted to Albany Medical Center, located over 60 miles away. Dorset Fire Chief Jacob Gribble explained that the Manchester Fire Department had to set up a landing zone for the helicopter. LifeNet of New York, a medical transport service, dispatched a specially qualified paramedic and nurse to provide critical care during the flight. During the police department's press conference, Lieutenant Steve Coote explained that Treat Williams was being treated by EMS and was later pronounced deceased at Albany Medical Center. Authorities are awaiting further details from medical examiners regarding Williams's condition before his death. The Vermont State Police Department is conducting an ongoing investigation into the cause of the accident and determining who may be at fault. A crash reconstruction team is utilizing advanced technology, including drones to gather information and calibrate speeds. Treat Williams leaves us behind his wife. Pam Van Sant and their grown children, son Gil and daughter Ellie. Our thoughts and condolences go out to the Williams family during this difficult time. That's all we have for now on this tragic incident. Stay tuned for more updates as we learn further details about Treat Williams's accident. Let us remember Treat Williams for his incredible talent and the joy he brought to our screens. May he rest in peace. 